years, right? Mm mm-hmm. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, so every year is there some kind of a celebration? Or? Well, I mean, we we have our convention. Um, Digestive Disease Week is our is our big thing every year. We're always at Digestive Disease Week, and we just it just really we did a lot of promotion. Um, we're really proud of all we've accomplished. Um, we um, we've you know, have a beautiful new uh, IT and T facility that we're using to really um, help put on programs and. Um, educate uh, members of the gastroenterology field um, so I mean yeah we just a lot of promotion there's some celebration about 75 years we certainly recognize it in gastrointestinal endoscopy um, so yeah it's uh, it was definitely a fantastic year for for ASGA. So uh, is GIE the only um journal which is produced by ASG? Actually, we just started a new journal. Um, it launched this summer. Uh, it's called Video GIE. Um, it's a completely video-based online open access journal. Uh, and so, um, you know, it, endoscopy is a very visual field. So we found that our readers were really loving the fact that we were including videos in GIE and and it just spawned a whole new journal. So um, that's definitely um, something that there's been a lot of buzz about is uh, our launching of our second journal. Um, so uh, when you say it has a lot of video content, is it mm -hmm. mostly for the methods section or how the techniques are performed? Or? They're actually completely video based. It, each, each submission is a video with a short description. So you'll be able to see a variety of things, um, uh, you know, um, actual endoscopic practices, things like that. So. And you also have video abstracts? Um, the, well, the, those real, we do have video abstracts with um, in relationship to that. So what it will be is like a short abstract um, describing a video case, and then the case will be presented in solely video form. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, because in today's uh, keynote as well, uh, we heard that videos or you know new ways of disseminating information is something that we can expect. Especially with the whole digital transformation. Yeah, I definitely think that is. I think that we are seeing more and more readers want to look something up online and see, you know, an image or a video as opposed to maybe picking up a physical copy of the journal and just sitting there and reading it. Um, especially, we noticed that especially with a lot of our younger members, um, this, you know, was a really popular medium, um, which is also why we've gotten into more things like social media and podcasts. Uh, we're really trying to keep up with what, um, what our readers are interested in and the trends um, in the world of publishing.